Good day everyone, welcome back once again to my channel, the Great Check. And once again this is Jerry. And uh, in this video I'm gonna show you how I fixed my fellow teacher's uh, laptop. And uh, the problem that uh, he had encountered is that uh, he was uh, planning to print his document, just like uh, example this one. Uh, this file, he opened it and he wanted to print this. But the problem is that uh, he encountered a certain problem like uh, this one. He, uh, of course, he pressed Ctrl P for printing. But the problem is that in the printer part, uh, this part here, what displayed is no printers installed. So, um, he tried to, uh, of course, he tried uh, if, uh, of course, we, uh, we can still have this option, add printer. But uh, if you can see here, there are printers and scanners that uh, before he encountered this problem, he could, of course, use these uh, printers and scanners when he wanted to print uh, documents. But the problem is that it was not shown here, okay? And uh, if uh, you try to add a printer here, searching for printers and scanners, and uh, if I try to click this uh, option, the printer that I want is not listed. So this is the window that would appear. So Windows can open add printer. The local speed, uh, the local print spooler service is not running. Please restart the spooler or restart the machine. Okay, so uh, this window gives us uh, how to fix this uh, problem. So um, if you try to click this one too, and of course manage um, uh, if we try to have this like for example this um, of course the printers and scanners that are, are displayed here and uh, if i try to use this uh, printer that he used before epson l120 series and i uh, try to click this manage and of course uh, manage your device probably we could think that uh, we could uh, add this or uh, apply it or uh, display this on this printer, on this uh, part of this uh, printing uh, tab or option of the file tab of our Excel. Okay. So, uh, yes, this one, file tab for Excel, then these are the options. And uh, for the print part, this, uh, this, is, this, this one is displayed. So... Um, if we, of course, we um, try to have this, probably, to manage this device, and uh, you can see that the printer status is idle, so probably if it is idle, then it is uh, working, but it's not used, it's not, it is not being used. So um, I tried to print a test page this one I try to uh, click this then this would be the display so the operation could not be completed error blah 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 and still the suggestion is local print spooler service is not running please restart the spooler or restart the machine so uh, how to fix this problem how to find the print spooler service so that we could restart the spooler or we could restart the machine okay not this computer because i've tried to restart this one because i could not i wasn't yet able to send or to see i wasn't yet able to see the the problem so i tried to re restart the, the computer the laptop and then I tried to, of course, try to find the uh, restore points for system restore. 
but uh, since this is new, uh, he just bought this two months ago. So the problem is that uh, before he could uh, print any documents, but it just happened that this was the problem that he encountered, encountered, and then he, of course, has a problem, and he wanted me to fix this. He asked me to fix this uh, problem. So how? How to uh, fix the problem? Local print. Where can we find local print spoiler service to make it run? And uh, how to restart if it is possible or how to start this um, machine. Okay, so what we should do is uh, we have to just click OK. Anyway, we just close this and close this. And then try to uh, notice this one here. No printers installed yet. But when we fix the problem, we could see the many installed printers that he was enjoying before before he had this problem, the my fellow teacher. So uh, we just go to this um, search tab or uh, text box to search the thing that we want uh, to search. So for me, I want to search for the services. So I just have to type services. And here is the services option that we have, app. So I do have to run as administrator, and then I have this window. Okay, services. So uh, services, local, of course. And then there are many uh, services that you could see here. But what we are trying, I could not um, explain to you one by one for that. We just go to what we want to um, make or do or uh, restart a service to restart our machine, of course. And uh, because we are facing a problem for printing, so we have to find the print spooler as what is suggested. Print spooler, so PPPP, well, the, the good one for this, though it has so many options here, services here, but it is alphabetized, so it's easy for us to find what we want to find. So print spooler, you can see here, print spooler, okay? So this is the print spooler. So what is the description for print spooler? So the description is here. This service spools print jobs and handles interaction with the printer. So it's a descriptive that the print spooler is for printing and how to interact with the printer. If you turn this off, this service off, then you won't be able to print or see your printer. So what happens here is really what is described in the service specifically for print spooler service. So if you see here, the status for this service, print spooler, its status is, you see, others are running, but this one is not running so that means we have to run this one it has to be running to make it so or you could uh, be able to print and you could also see our printers so since this is turned off so we need to turn this on but we don't have the option to turn on but start the service so this is it so be sure that we have chosen the principaler because that is what we really have to uh, start or the, the the solution to our problem so it is highlighted and then start the service okay uh, try to have this this one here please notice this one here so it has no uh, running or whatever you can see here you cannot find or you cannot see anything here but if you start the service then, you see, 
it is running now so since this is running automatically the your excel you see this one here okay so it's displayed now all the printers that my fellow teachers have been enjoying to use it's now shown here so that's it oh uh, so um that's how to solve this problem so if you have the same problem of course you can follow this instruction the way we have uh talked here and what is shown here this would help hopefully or probably could help you in your problem also to solve it so uh thanks for watching guys and uh, hopefully that um if you like this content you could also click or uh, strike your subscribe button please if you have friends that have problem same problem with this you can also share it to them and of course don't forget to like the video thanks for watching guys have a nice day bye bye see you in the next video thanks and have a happy new year